when you wake up, you're still believing all of the same things. There's nothing you can do about it, and Seth will take it, and it's just something that you know you just got, yeah, yeah, it's hell, man. Before I went into hospital, I was taking drugs every day, uh, party pills and weed and drinking, and I didn't sleep for maybe four or five days. I had just wanted to keep going, so I stayed awake all night and wrote and wrote and wrote about all sorts of things. I would say I was quite unlucky because my mum is schizophrenic, so I already had a chance of becoming psychotic. I think my own drug use may have contributed. I'm still not sure. There's a lot of what we don't understand about how the brain works. We're kind of finding more and more out about that over time. Life experiences, perhaps turning on or off genes, resulting in people being more susceptible to experiencing things like psychosis. I think a lot of different things triggered it. Um, the lack of sleep, um, having a really stressful period in my life up until that point, um, just pressures with work. Um, I'd been in a bicycle accident and may or may not have had a concussion, so I was having medication for that. When I first started dealing with the psychosis, it felt like I was like, you know, a martyr for the world. For the person I was, the things I'd done, and for the people I knew, you know, I caused a lot of, you know, a lot of bad, a lot of harm. This is what the voices were telling me, you know? And I was a bad person for that, you know, and I deserved to be dead. And because of that, the world was gonna kill me because of that. Psychosis can happen to anyone and does happen to anyone, and we all have a breaking point where we might experience psychosis or maybe depression or, or mania or other sorts of mental health difficulties. Psychosis is treatable and, and recovery is expected, so we expect people to get better, get on with their lives, um, and when you're experiencing it, it can feel terrifying and feeling like it's never going to be right again. But look, we see, we engage with people, we see people get better and get on with their lives and thrive and actually come out stronger and better um, because they've learnt a lot about themselves and about the world 